Hey guys, welcome to the show. Today we're checking out WAN 2.2 Animate, or at least the, the professional grade version of it. We're going to be using Higgsfield AI's recast feature, which uses WAN 2.2 Animate under the hood. Now, previously I used WAN with my Mac Studio, the latest, the biggest model there, and it ran very, very slow. And the, even the biggest, biggest model, that one didn't run, required way too much memory. And I have learned a few things since then, so I might jump back into it if this is any good. Now, in case you don't know, WAN Animate allows you to not just change the face of the character that's being displayed, it also mimics the body movements accurately really really well so we're gonna see how it does and the good thing about it also is that it is open source and open weights so you can go ahead and try it running it yourself on your computers and if you're interested if you want a guide on how to do it with this feature let me know in the description below but let's just see if it's worth our time so we're going to be using higgsfield ai recast feature which uses it under the hood it says that generations take around how long does it take right it's 30 seconds to two minutes and it's not just a normal face swap. It's doing some cool stuff in between. And I love this demonstration video they have. They got this dude, kind of a nerdy looking dude, kind of like myself, and he turns into this uh, beautiful lady. So, you know, just be careful when you're watching consuming videos. I don't need to tell you this. You guys know, kids of the future, nothing is real. Everything is real. Wow. All right, so to use this situation, you upload a video and provide a character image. I'm gonna jump ahead and get some of these reference online images. And this is a kind of a complicated one. He's throwing a hat in the air and then he puts it on. Not much facial expressions. Don't know if that's gonna be a challenge for AI or not. It's a challenge for me not making much facial expressions. So this guy's nailed it. So we're gonna be replacing him and maybe we'll grab, put her face. So we'll put her face on his movements and let's just see what happens there. So the animation is now in progress, it says generations take around five minutes and this request uses 42 credits. I'm on the ultimate plan and that gives me 1,200 credits per month, which is good because that means that 42 credits is okay to play with. All right, look at this. We've got the animation. Oh, she is doing under that straight face. Oh, the hat, the hat. <laughs> It turned in. Okay, this is a funny video. I'm going to download this. Now, while that's doing that, I'm going to do a second generation. I've got this lady here. She's eating cake and she's doing lots of hand movements. Lots of stuff is happening there. And I replaced it with a dude they suggested to use. So it's kind of like a reverse now. I turned it into a man into a woman. Now I'm turning a woman into a man. Generate that video. And let's get that on the queue. So in case you don't know, Higgsfield AI, they pretty much got all of the models. They got Sora, they got VO, they got WAN, they got all this stuff, they got all these features, Higgsfield apps. So you can do all of these interesting jobs. We saw the recast one, we've got video face swap, you got character swap, you got lots of different stuff. And what I love about this is if you actually click on one of the images, it actually tells you the prompt they use to generate this. So you can just copy that copy the clipboard and you can recreate this scene or a very similar scene from it. Now, while we wait for that, for even more advanced generations, you can go into the character tab over here and there's Recast Studio. You can actually get a lot more control. So it tells you five to 15 seconds of motion or a scene and you get to choose characters. So you don't, don't need to upload a video yourself. You can choose one of these guys. So we got, uh, <laughs> I love these. This is gonna be fun. <laughs> All right, the plush, plushian's good. And lots of beautiful people on this page. I kind of want to do this. And uh, you can even choose a voice. Oh, look at that. So you can dub the voices. That is amazing. And change the background. Luxury masculine. They got a bedroom scene. They got some very beautiful people. I think I know these people's target market. But let's just see uh, professionals. Oh, this is a fun situation. So let's just wait for that video to make and then we see the eating scene as well as the hat throwing scene and see how it's... Oh, this looks good. <laughs> this looks good. <laughs> let's see. It's the dude. They've made his face less pixelated. I provided it a really bad version of this. He's doing the hand movements. He's looking confused. He's got the face. Okay, the cakes gooed up a little bit. Oh, there's a little bit of artifacts, which is... I think it's good, so we can still decipher what the truth is, but it's mostly there. 
it's mostly there. So this technology is getting really, really good. So if you are interested, this was Higgsfield. Lots of stuff to do, different pricing strategies. You can check out the description for a link. And here again, you got lots of stuff. You got the Raven effect, you got the, the tongue effect, you got all the cool stuff. And my favorite thing about it is if you do like any of their samples, you can just click on it and it tells you the prompt they use to make this generation. You click on that and it copies it to your clipboard so you can recreate the scenes yourself. Let me know what you guys think, especially of, especially of my recast studio edit. I like that one. And yeah, hope you guys found this video useful and enjoyed the show.